What is going on, y'all? It's your boy 3NG. We are back with another video. Now, if you take a look here, I don't know how accurate this is, right? But it says box office mojo. Top lifetime grosses. Number one says Avatar. Number two is Endgame. Number three, Titanic. Number four, Star Wars. We got Avengers Infinity War, Spider-Man No Way Home, Jurassic World, Lion King, so on and so forth, right? Today, they just dropped. Six hours ago, 5.9 million views already on this bitch. Avatar, the Way of Water official trailer. We're going to go ahead and watch this. This is much more lengthier. I know the previous trailer that we had saw. I'm not sure how accurate, but I do know that it was a very short trailer just showing cinematic. Um, but in this case, we're going to see much more. Let me just make sure that this is the exact, right? Um... Not gonna lie, man, this movie is powerful. The reason why Avatar is powerful, there's so much different shit. You guys are smarter than me, and I'm always gonna put y'all forward, right? So for all those who are really our big movie buffs, please even educate the youth, even myself. I may not know everything. But Avatar came out during a time where CG, CGI wasn't at its craziest peak, and the way they mastered this movie, the storyline too let alone, but the way they mastered this movie with CG. And then I heard somewhere, I read somewhere that the person who, you know, created Avatar had this vision for Avatar when they were a kid. So, you know, this is deep, it's deep. I could be wrong about that part, but there's a lot of stuff that goes on with this, but just kids. Avatar for the time that it came out was so huge. You know how sometimes things come out and it's like, damn, it was too advanced for its time. Well, no, the success of Avatar and how advanced it was with the CGI was amazing because it had, it didn't look like a fight scene. Like I remember in one of the Spider-Man movies with Tobey Maguire, he was fighting and when things blew up, you could tell that it was CG right there. No, this, the way it meshed together was amazing. So let's go ahead and watch Avatar, the way, of the, uh, the way of Water. I think it releases in December, if I'm not mistaken. But I know we got Wakanda coming up, Wakanda forever. Um, I just saw Black Adam, great film. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. It's your boy 3MG. Make sure you comment, like, subscribe. Also follow the gaming channel 3MG Plays and in the Twitch 3MG Live. All right, let's get it. Oh my God. The mute. Why do I have goosebumps? I have goosebumps already. She's pregnant. Looks amazing. I hear her heartbeat. Oh, we'll check after this. So what does her heartbeat sound like? Oh. Oh my god, the picture. Oh my god. Yo, this shit looks so good. Okay. This is what we thought That's graphics and video games were gonna look like. I see you. Am I the only one that's getting like Wakanda vibes? I, I'm only saying because of the 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 culture of, of like the way everyone is coming together and the music. And it's very dri it feels very driven by that. So, you know, it's Avatar. This shit is like I think man, I could imagine how many movies spawned after this film came out. Y'all don't understand, this film looks amazing for CG. Mixed, you know? And after your death. What? This is our home! Look how perfect that I looks. Oh my god. Oh my god, I got goosebumps. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I got to look this up. We got to look this up. Oh my God. Y'all don't understand. There's so many movies. Listen, my, being a content creator fucked up my brain cells. I'll be forgetting shit. Okay. I forget so much shit. Forgive me. But I just want to say when this film came out, you don't understand. I have relatives, older relatives, youngins. I was young. I was in high school when this came out. I was like graduating high school. I think Ubisoft is even supposed to drop an avatar game. Do we trust them to make it? We don't know. We'll, we'll, we will see. But this, I think so many movies spawned and, and, and really grew from just the success of Avatar. You guys don't know 
how they literally were like the master craft behind CG and how to really mesh CG with realism together. And it's we thought video games was gonna look like this shit. I ain't gonna lie. I can only imagine how powerful this trailer was and is to so many people. You have the return of, of, of course, Zoe Zaldana, who is Dominican. Shout out to my Dominican people out there. You know what I'm saying? You have Sam Worthington. Sam Worthington. Forgive me if I botched his name. Forgive me. But to know that now they have kids years later, they're older, that everything that's going on is very family driven, oriented, war going on. You can just tell from the music, the theatrics. I feel like. There's a piece of Black Panther. There's a piece of the Avengers, the theatrics. I'm talking about big time movies that spawned after, that came out after. I feel like this inspiration has just picked from so many films. I'm not saying that like the Avengers is made because of it, but you could just tell that there's so much put into these films. And I think the success of Avatar really spawned a lot of inspiration to a lot of the films that we get now that really be hitting because there's some movies now that drop they garbage but then you get some of these big time blockbuster films and i feel like they all get that same kind of like passion and curation of just like with theatrical music it's just really dropping that bomb on everybody and that's what avatar did you could just tell from each each song or, or instrumental that's playing in, in the trailer that there's either something big going on powerful something sad something happy and that's very big with movies too um this shit is different. Any all my Avatar fans out there, please comment below. What are your hopes? And I'm not gonna lie. You know how sometimes you could tell from a trailer if a movie's gonna be trash. At no point do I feel or felt that there's gonna be some bullshit in this film. You can literally tell and get a sense of how good a movie can be based off its trailer. Black Adam drops. I like the film, but I can just tell there there was gonna be some hiccups. When you see Wakanda Forever, and every time I watch that trailer that a tear sheds, I feel like they're going to go even bigger and even harder because of the passing of Chadwick Boseman. Chad, Chadwick Boseman. And I feel like they're going to have to now pay even more homage and really show even more love and respect for the film and him and himself, and they're going to go even harder. So you could already tell what's going to happen with these films. Like, that's just me. That's just how I kind of grasp trailers and movies that's how i digest this shit so please let me know what you guys think in the comment section below man this was a big one for me um i'm gonna have to go back watch the first avatar really just all the characters everyone and just kind of absorb that we could probably do that in my discord link will be in the description below movie night all that good shit but we got to we have to um i love y'all man kos follow me on twitch it's twitch.tv slash 3mg live we go live all the time we play some games horrors reactions i said horrors horror reactions and all that good shit then on 3mg plays on youtube man we're playing our cods 2ks and all that fun shit man love y'all it's your boy 3mg and i'm out peace